This is lecture 10, selecting P high when transitioning from traditional mechanical ventilation. And this is under section 4, initial setup of P high. Now, the way to do this is to find a target P high setting. Ideally, you want to do a plateau maneuver or measure a plateau pressure. And you do this by inspiratory hold maneuver. Where what we're looking at is this is a screenshot from a Hamilton G5 ventilator and we are performing an inspiratory hold maneuver. So the tab came up, I selected tools and under tools I'm allowed to do an inspiratory hold. So the inspiratory hold allows me to hold the inspiratory um, portion of the breath and as you start to notice it here it's starting to lengthen it out in my pressure waveform. This next slide demonstrates that this is the end of the hold maneuver right here and I can obtain my plateau pressure measurement. As you notice my peak pressure is 27 centimeters of water up in the left hand corner and what I did is I did an inspiratory hold maneuver and then when I stopped it um, with this software it automatically froze the screen and I'm just going to highlight this and as you can see, there's the little snowflake. And I scrolled back to measure. As you can see, these arrows down here. So I scrolled back to check out my plateau pressure during the inspiratory hold. And as you notice, the pressure reading is right there. And my pressure is 25.7. So I'm going to, this is my plateau pressure. And I'm going to use this measurement as a guide to set my P high. Now I'm going to use my ventilator simulator to show you how to transition from traditional mechanical ventilation to APRV based on a plateau pressure measurement. Now I'm actually in pressure control ventilation and sometimes my peak pressure are equal to the plateau. And with the simulator I'm not allowed to do an inspiratory hold maneuver which is the ideal way to get a plateau measurement. I can look under monitoring and I can see right here I'm kind of moving my cursor around and you can see the plateau pressure is 28 but this is just a measured value it's not a true value however no my a plateau pressure and pressure control when flow fully decelerates I'm looking at my flow waveform here and my inspiratory flow is fully decelerating it becomes a no flow state so my plateau pressure should be pretty much equal to my peak so let's say my um, plateau pressure is 28. I want to set up my P high in APRV approximately 2 centimeters water above this. So I'm just going to go to my modes. I'm going to select APRV. And I'm going to confirm it. And then I'd select my P high. And I'd move that 2 centimeters of water above my plateau pressure or measured plateau pressure. So it's 28, so I want to start at 30. So as long as it's not above 30, I mean, there's instances which I've talked about or mentioned that you might want to use more than 30 centimeters of water. So that's how you would set your P high or target a P high based on measurements from your traditional mode of mechanical ventilation.